Wish you were here. Hello, City Paper readers and fans. This is William Philpack coming to you from the Hip Hop Theater Festival here at 1501, the Studio Theater. We are here to celebrate hip hop's greatness and finest in the Washington, D.C. metropolitan area. Those that have come here, those that are from here, those that are not from here. So we're going to take it over, we're going to talk to a couple of people, see what it's all about, see what all the interest is about, see what the buzz is about, and let you recognize why the city paper is here. How you doing? I'm Vonda Wizabellos. I'm with the Creative Writing Alliance. I'm 19 years old. Um, we're from Parkdale High School in Maryland. Now, now, or now I go to ECSU in North Carolina. I have my own poetry group called Free Minds Poets. Um, poetry, rap, hip hop, I'm an artist. Um, and yeah. All right, my name is Patrick M., also known as Pages, possessing artistic gifts eloquently spoken. I'm 20 years old, a part of the Creative Writing Alliance, but I also have my own group entitled The Movement Poets, and we have The Elite, which stands for which is my band. We do a lot of hip hop, jazz type pieces. Um, yeah, I currently attend University of Maryland and I'm going to college to Coleman Park Campus. Shout out to Mr. Bryant. And yeah. Hey, shout out his teacher. <laughs> I'm Janiah, I'm 16 with the Creative Writing Alliance. Um, I'm new to the team uh, from PG. And uh, my name is Reggie Kubiko. I'm the artistic director for Soul and Soul, and uh, we just did a show called Elegies in the Key of Funk. It's a new theatrical spoken word hip hop theater piece. Like, there's so much energy going on. And it's like, yo, you, like, you know, there's gonna be a great show, but then when you're actually there, it's like it's even greater than you could even thought that you even thought that it was gonna be. So it's always amazing to. Be a part of I like the um, diversity, like this slam poets and movement poets and all that. Like, it's so much different stuff together. Like, it's not all like one type. It's like a different variety of different artistic forms. I really just look forward to the creativity. I think that just coming in and seeing how different people just, just do their own thing, I think it's, it's a beautiful thing. I'm David. <laughs> I'm David E. Beats. I'm a producer from the DMV area. Um, I produce, well, right now I'm doing some things for Malau. I'm produced for Jungs. I produce for uh, Pac Div. Um, <laughs> Lyricist. <laughs> I produce. I, I, uh, Exo just asked me for two beats. You know, I got beats on a lot of folks, so I produce as well. Uh, so that's what I do. I'm 20 years old, just turned 20. And uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> and that's about it. Um, this is to try to shed some light on the subject uh, because allergies can be really dark. So um, we just think this sheds a little bit of light and uh, that's what it's about. This will never be reviewed by the Washington Post because it's not theatrical enough. But uh, I, I think that this is where theater is going to be and this is what's going to challenge the fourth wall. You name me one show with a gay Filipino and a queer uh, South Asian man talking. So to me, hip hop theater is anything that is not white. What exactly does hip hop mean to you? Save my life. Hip hop is a Hip hop is a Hip Shout out to Mr. Washington right there. That's our coach, Creative Writing Alliance right there. That's our Don't coach. Don't let this guy do all the talking. <laughs> <laughs> I really have a lot of respect for anybody that can just like put their soul out there and, and not even not even care, it's just like, here, take it. And I think that that's when you really feel like an artist, that's when you see a real performer, that's when you, like, that's when you feel it the most, is when you just see somebody and they really just put their heart and soul into it. And I think that's what's the most beautiful thing about it, it's just, you have so many different people doing, doing things so many different ways, and it, it just, you know, it brings a whole new aspect to what you're doing.